everyone, my name is Joanna and I'm here today at Government House and I'm standing in front of our very magnificent, very large portrait of Queen Victoria. Now we've already done a video about Queen Victoria, but I'd love to tell you another story about this painting, my favorite story about this painting. Our copy was finished in 1903 by local artist C.S. Hatch, but this is the second painting. There was another painting uh, done. It was begun around 1899 and it was completed in 1901, the same year that Queen Victoria died. Now the painting was um, paid for by a London businessman and the Queen, Queen Victoria, she didn't want to sit for the painting. You can understand, it's nearing the end of her life. She's probably sat for many, many portraits. So she says no. And her son, the Prince of Wales, who goes on to become king, says basically, mom, you really should. So she says, all right, but the sitting is not to last any longer than 20 minutes. So she comes in, she's sitting uh, in this beautiful chair in I believe the um, Palace of Westminster. And the artist, jean joseph Benjamin Constant, sits down and he just uh, puts his head in his hands and stares at the queen for 20 minutes. Now this rather surprises the queen, but the artist's point was he'd never be able to paint all of this in 20 minutes. Now, yes, he probably could go back in and look at the chair and the setting around, but he only had 20 minutes with the queen and he wanted to remember every single detail. He went away, he painted um, uh, the painting that was completed in 1901. The royal family bought it eventually, and now that painting hangs in the state dining room at Windsor Castle. So if you ever have a chance to go, take a peek, see if you can see it, but I much prefer ours here in Regina, Saskatchewan. So my question to you is, if you could have a quite large painting of anyone in your house, who would you pick? Please let us know in the comments. Thank you for watching and have a great day.